Wimborne will travel back to Dorset tonight with a point after a hard-fought 1-1 draw with Tiverton this afternoon. New signing Ryan Wignall came straight into the team and he patrolled the left flank with Alex Parsons. Alex Parsons playing left back midfield and Ryan Wignall playing on the left up front. Max Cream was on the right, and Tom Jeffs and Matt Kimball in, in, in the middle up front in a very attacking lineup from the Magpies. After a good start, it was Matt Kimball who put Wimborne ahead on 13 minutes after George Webb swept a ball out to Wignall. His cross was nodded on by Tom Jeffs and Kimball was there at the far post. But Wim Wimborne's joy was short-lived because in the very next minute, it was the Tiverton number two, Aaron Dawson, who finished off a good move by cutting inside the Wimborne defence and planting his shot past past Jason Harville. For the rest of the half, the home side were marginally the better team, but it finished all square at half time. In the second half, as was to be expected, Tiverton pressed and had more of the ball, but the more the game went on, the more Wimborne looked likely to get the winner. And in fact, in the last 10 minutes, they probably had the better chances. Jason Harville had one or two good saves in the game, but wasn't really called upon very much to, to, to save the Magpies. So Steve Cuss and his lads will be very pleased after a day that started badly when our coach broke down at Chiddock. And we got, we got here with at quarter to three and were forced to, to warm up for only 40 minutes. So a good result for Wimborne, 1-1, next Saturday, home to Bridgewater, we hope to see you there. And I'm joined now by Magpie boss Steve Cuss after Wimborne's 1-1 draw at Tivert this afternoon. Steve, a battling performance, you must be pleased with the lads. Very much so, yeah, it was a battling performance, I think you'd always take a point away from home, uh, difficult circumstances in getting here. Um, but you know, overall, I think we were we were worthy of a point yeah. as well. A new boy, Ryan Wignall, you threw him straight, and the team they didn't let you down. No, I mean it was a big decision whether to start him or to, to use him from the bench. Um, went with playing him from the start. I thought he did really well today. Uh, I was nearly brought him off with 10 minutes to go. He's looking a bit tired, but I just thought he had a little bit in him that he might just snatch us the winning goal. And he came close to the shot from that side of the box. So, I mean, overall, we're pleased with him as I'm pleased with all the boys today. And uh, quite an attacking lineup, probably the most attacking lineup we've had this season. Yeah, I think for the past, you know, two or three weeks in training, we've been working on, you know, our attacking play. So, you know, we backed uh, the players today with a team selection, and you know, we tried to be a little bit more, you know, forward thinking. Yeah, good performance today. Thanks very much. Thank Steve. you.